Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is the player camera manager? Stop all instances of camera anim. And I think this is the longest node I've had to cover because it barely fits on my title card. Let's go and run this and we'll take a look at how it works. When I hit play anims, and again, if you've watched the other videos, you may have seen me already have to fix this multiple times. I keep forgetting to put a higher scale, so these are easier to see. There we go. And we'll hit play again, and we'll hit play anims. And you'll notice we have all of our anims started. Now we have a rotational animation. Now we have a forward and backwards location animation. When we hit stop all instances, you'll find, well, it's not as easy to tell here. Let me... Let, let's stop the other. Oh, actually, we're not, we're not doing anything because I didn't click on this. That was lovely. So, as you can see, if you hit the stop all instances button and you don't have it set up properly, nothing happens. Let me set this up properly and show you how it's supposed to work. Now you notice the rotation and when we hit stop, you'll notice the rotation stops, but our forward and backward momentum is still going. And it's a little hard to see make it really annoying let's see if that works better oh there we go and you'll notice the forward and backward is much more pronounced but we are now stopping just the rotation so let's look at the node hopefully properly set up this time the stop all instances of camera anim is intended to stop all of the instances or these actual objects these class types that you have playing is pulled off of our player camera manager under camera animation and see stop all instances of camera anim node. Now by default it comes like this. It has no animation, no anim reference set up and immediate is unchecked. It is pulled off of the camera manager so you know which in player to run it off of as the target. The anim is going to be the anim reference. Unlike the stop version where it takes a camera anim reference here which is a camera anim reference of an already playing instance the anim reference here and this is really annoying that they're almost all named the same if you notice this one says camera anim ref and this one says camera anim reference and this one is a camera anim instance reference the key here is when you have an individual one playing the reference to it is a reference to an instance. The actual camera anim itself is a camera anim reference. What that means is when you select one here, you're going to get an actual object or a class, something you've created that has an animation inside of it, not one that may or may not be actually playing inside your world. So in this case, we'll select camera anim, the first one. So when we hit play, you'll notice it will stop the rotation. It will not stop the forward and backward momentum because that is a camera anim 2, whereas the first one is our camera anim. Now immediate is unchecked, but the issue you're going to have here is when you tell it to stop and immediate is not checked, it uses the blend out time to determine how it should blend, how long it should take to go back to the beginning rotation, or your, your beginning values, not rotation. I'm using rotation in this example, but your beginning values. By default, your play nodes have no blend out time. We need to change this to give it a blend out time of one second, and now when we stop it, you'll notice it now rotates back smoothly, over one second rather than stopping abruptly. Now if we slow down our rate time to something a little slower you can see this in more detail. We are slowly rotating and then when I stop we'll slowly rotate back to our original position. We're no longer running the first camera anim and we're just running the second. Now of course if you check immediate and hit play it's going to go ahead and snap it back it will ignore the blend out time. 
So that's it. That's going to wrap up our stop all instances of camera anim node. It's intended to stop a specific instance. The instances are the ones that you've created outside, inside of your content browser, inside of Matinee. And it's useful, for example, maybe you have one plane a rotation, one plane a translation, maybe one plane a color fade, and you want the player, the player gets hit by a bomb, and you have one rotating and shaking the screen, and then you have one changing the color, so that way it looks like they're hit. Someone heals them, but they still are affected by the trauma from the bomb. So you go ahead and just stop the instance of the healing one, so that way their screen is still shaking, but you want the healing animation to stop, maybe fade back from the red pulsing back to the white, without affecting the actual rotation and shock of the bomb. So it allows you to stop an individual one. And it's useful, for example, if you have multiples, like you're blending multiples of the same instance together. Maybe you play two different ones that cover blood because you want a different, more pronounced effect. That's going to wrap up our node.